Miller greetings, fellow champions, and welcome back to Story of Seasons, a wonderful life, where we are doing our last two days of winter of year two of the branching chapter, well, year two break the branching chapter, uh, not of the branching chapter. I don't know how many years this chapter has, and I'm really looking forward to finding out. We have just ordered our processing facility. So we can now start making cheese and other stuff as soon as that actually gets installed. Oh, we're up for a sunny day. Luck is amazing, so we might go digging for some spoons. Our daughter really wants up. Because we need to replace all of the money we just spent to build that processing facility. Morning! And we're back to being a huggy monster. Okay, down. You asked for that hug. You literally requested the hug. Children, am I right? And we are waiting for Shari to give birth. Trying to work out where we put all of our sheep. Basically, life is good, is where we were going. <sighs> As always, just glad to be back in. Sorry if I'm going silent, I feel like I'm about to sneeze. And I'd rather not do that <laughs> while I'm recording. So just trying to uh, manage that. And I'm trying to be a bit nicer to Farron because I've 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 been very mean to the horse and he doesn't deserve that. It's not his fault that I'm an idiot. The lamb will be born soon. Not even a few days, so probably later today, we will have a new addition to our family. And I need to get some money up, because at some point, we are going to need the next layer of tools. I'm actually surprised that they haven't shown up yet. Got some happy moo cows. I will actually let them out today. Out you go, guys. Enjoy the outside world. And good morning to the chickens. And the duckins. <coughs> we love you, Madam Cluck. <coughs> mm. And down goes the sleepless duck. Seriously, do the ducks ever sleep? Grabbing. 
because we really need more fertilizer for all of our trees. Uh, I do apologize if I'm sort of fading in and out with my uh, my commentary, guys. I'm. It's been a long day. It, it's. And I'm honestly just enjoying being here and being able to play. And sometimes I'll get so caught up in just being here and playing that I forget that I'm supposed to be talking as well. So I do hope that you will forgive me any trespass in that respect. And we're fertilizing. I'm very, very excited to see what's going to happen next, so kind of part of me wants to rush through this but I also feel like I've been rushing the gameplay a lot and I do have a very difficult decision to make in the very near future so um, looks like nobody here needs fertilizing <gasps> our new sheepy what shall we call our sheepy Name it something nice. Are you gonna tell me it's gender? Alright, we're gonna call you Joker. I don't know why, it's just the first name that came into my head. I wanted to swap them. Nice to meet you, nice to greet you! Welcome to the family, Joker. I will come and greet you very shortly. Oh, wow. Alright, so it's just trees. I like this. I like this a lot. Hopefully these guys will finish their sprouting very soon. Is a tanberry one of the things that we needed? I don't remember anymore. Oh! <gasps> Speed turn! Was that one of the things we needed? I feel like it's a turnip variant and we need a carrot. So hopefully one of those guys will pop. And I was also very low energy. I sat up quite late in the end of the last episode, if I recall. That was it. All oh, right, where am I going? Oh, that's right. I wanted to go see Joker. Shari, you done good. Hello, little one. Put out some food for you. And why do I have is this for when I expand the barn? Joker is in fact a girl. Okay, alright. If the sprite said that, I completely missed it because I wasn't paying enough attention. Alright, let's go see if 
there's anything with the sprites. Pwee! Oh, you would be cold. And milk. Oh, you mama fluff off to you too. Got a recipe for me? <sighs> Alright, I must have to up my cooking. This happened at the end of the last episode as well, so... Oh, hey Muff. Um, apparently I'm hungry. Let's eat it. So it's a multi-ingredient recipe. Oh, I've got to give that curry to Matt as well. Alright, we've done all of our deliveries except for the salad that I can't make, although I should check. Uh, we were fishing for something, what was it? Oh, the scad, yeah, okay, we, deli we delivered it that. And flowers. Hmm. And we're picking flowers. Everybody's out and about. I really should stop and say hi to everyone. She says running away. Alright, let's go back. Hi, everyone. I keep saying hello. No. Oh, I'm just saying hello to everybody. Good day. Hmm. Once again, I find myself at a loss on what I should be doing. I actually kind of enjoy that sensation. Max LP with eight animals. Daisy's looking good. Hey, child. Oh, a turnip. Should I be seeding these out, or should I keep them, do you think? Strawberries are almost ready. Alright, I might seed them, because they're the higher level. Let's... I don't think... It was the tomatoes and the carrots. It's not going to work for that recipe. So, we will seed them up. We 
work out where her husband went. Put this away for our next trip. Organize all the things so that they're in a correct order. There we go. Much better. And go say hi to Vinny. Because I've been neglectful. And unlike everybody else, Vinny's friendship does decay. And we don't want it to decay. Keep talking. Uh, we're back to the elf critters. Okay, just hit chat. Strong Miller and I really should be writing all these down. Those suggested mixes, not everything that Vinny says. Like that one. Strong Miller and Picaro. You just repeated that. Alright, that should keep Vinny happy with me. Now, where is my husband? Ah, there. Perfect. Husband, wait. I have food. It matches your eyes. Aww. And I got sleepy ducks and chickens, and I've got something in my eye that's not my eyeball. Ah, that's better. And sleepy moo cows, and I have a daughter around somewhere, I'm sure. She gets lost in the long grass. I really should do something about that. Alright, so we're going to cut down a bit more grass because we are getting into rapid grass growing season. And I think after that, we'll do the evening animal care and then we'll do some cooking. As always, just cutting out random sections of grass so that the rest will grow nice and neatly. I know I did this yesterday, so I'm probably taking a little bit too much, but that's okay. At least I think it's okay. I, I, I don't think it's gonna hurt our overall growth. Might hurt my overall stamina. Right, let's put you guys away. I'll put out some food for you all shortly. Put the chickens away. Begin the hunt for the eggs. Because nobody left me eggs in the barn this morning in the coop. Hey, gold. Good spot. Why can't you guys leave eggs in the bare spaces more often? Was a chook hanging out? Ah, over here. Okay, alright, I'm content with that. Two fertilized and a gold. That's that's not bad. Hello, has everybody said hello to our new friend? Because we do, we we have a new friend now. Her name is Joker. And she's adorable. talk to you. I want to put food in your tray. I had it there for a second. There it is. Ha! Found it! Bree is doing pretty good. That's good, because hopefully tomorrow the facility will get built and we'll be able to make cheese. Well, I'll be able to work out how to make cheese.
Alright, that is, I see. I'll put out some extra food for you. Alright, two for butters. And this is why we like getting to the animals. Uh, Alright, we'll come back. So that we have time to be all pampery. That's going to bring our, hopefully, and I guess it depends on the cycle. But that brings our, our wool quotient up quite a lot, which will be a fantastic, stabilizing our income some more. How y'all doing? I really do hope that everything flowers or um, fruits overnight. Fruiting is the correct term, yes. If I lose that many crops, I am going to be so very ticked. And down goes the sleepless duck. Seriously, have we ever seen the ducks asleep? I genuinely don't think we have. Alright, we'll do one last quick peek. Uh, everything's all blue. Did I water? I feel like I watered. I feel like I shouldn't have to at this time of night. Let's go home to my family. Interesting place to set up shop, Daisy. Ah, oh, just in time for Matt to go to bed. And me too. Ah, to sleep. Perchance to dream of cows. Here, sweetie, hold up a sec. You're gonna water for me today. Is it raining? It's cloudy. Mostly cloudy skies. Luck is good. No, you like the blue curry. Hi. All right, you don't want me to pick you up today. Probably because you just sat down. You need to pick up though. I haven't played with your little toe beans for a while. Does the cat not hate me anymore? <gasps> Ewok's neutral! We have hit neutrality with Ewok! I feel like we have achieved a great task here, somehow. And Shara is all floofy! And snuggle. I oh, know that's going to be in my head for hours. All it takes with a good earworm is just one word, one, one snippet, one moment, and that tune is going to haunt you for hours. I'm actually okay with that normally. How you doing, butters? Alright, no cranky bubble. Bree is doing good. And a snuggle for Bree. 
And a brush, brush, brush for Joker. I'm not. I'm actually not quite used to this. I don't normally have this many animals on the farm. I, I tend to keep it quite limited. So to have a full barn for me is. It's a rare thing. And a lot of it, I think, has to do with the fact that they uh, create themselves. <laughs> Everybody outside! While you're all outside. One, two, three, four, five. Seriously, Butters, how did you empty your trough twice? I'm both impressed and terrified. There we go. I would prefer to, to realign it so that the doubles and the singles are all sort of lined up more neatly, but alas, it is not to be. Hey, Rocky. Huh. Quackers. I didn't even know you could raise golden eggs. Oh, you guys are all going to do this. Because there's only one freaking egg in the barn. I love you, Madam Clock. Was it your egg? I've already seen to Rocky. Hey, you're awake. You're finally awake. Alright, that's everybody. Alright, and I don't need to water anything today because the husband's doing that for me. So, let's put that away. Grab out the uh, fertilizer. Fertilize our tree. <gasps> our trees don't need fertilizing. This one does. Have we finally achieved almost maximum fruit? Okay, we have two of them. Four of them! We're getting there! I have been so worried about that, genuinely. You guys don't need a fertilizer. And you better fruit today or I'm gonna lose you all. I have spent so much money and so much time raising you all, trying to get you to your maximum potential. So I'll just keep an eye on you all day. A shwickle. Did she ever get it right? And it's been a year. She, she should understand by now. Huh? Huh? Ooh, long. Yes. Zoom out. Yes. 
all of my photos will be of my child. And maybe my husband. Oh, that's a good look. I'll be opening inside now. sounds. Does this mean I can get an event? Pretty flowers do smell very good. I wish I could actually give you a flower, my child. You are a very useful husband of mine. Sort of. Seriously? Does my facility not get built today? I don't even know where it's gonna go. Is it gonna go here? That would make some sense. Or is it gonna go here where there's sort of this scruffy patch? I would imagine that's more for the expansion of the, the barn than anything like that. Alright, is Pui by the bridge. Do I even have enough money to give him? No. Just Gary. Alright, let's do what cooking we may. Because I am partly convinced that the current lack of recipes is because I've not been cooking enough. Right, let's see what hors d'oeuvres we can do. Oh, the veggie tempura was a good one. Um, really? I can only use one of my sweet potatoes? Spiral herb, huddle herb. Just one. Okay, I'm trying to. You're pushing me around the kitchen. Meanie. When did I unlock a sandwich? Okay, that requires specific fishies. Let's make some more blue curry. Keep the hubby happy. Because a happy hubby is, well, what I would prefer to have. And make some more milky soup. Is there a way to add additional ingredients? Like the boxes are there, but they're all X'd out, so maybe when I get to a higher level do I get that option? Also, can you give my child food? Come on, grab more confident with your cooking. I know I'm gonna need to do a lot of this to achieve that, but Ooh, I can make ice cream. Apple jam, blue jam? You know what? I'm making the blue jam. I've got I've read Percy Jackson too many times, I've got a thing for blue food. Doesn't hurt the blue's my favourite colour as well. Okay. Absolutely. I 
I would take you to see your friend if you would tell me who your friend is. And it's not Daisy, as much as it should be. Every child should have a puppy. Oh, I'm really, really worried that these guys are not going to mature in time. <gasps> Keratin! Is that one of the things I needed? Can I make the egg salad? Alright, well we've got some changes ticking over, but I suspect that we're going to lose this lot. I do need a carrot derivative. But it was carotene included? Turnip? Turnberry? Oh no! 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 Don't tell me that I just uh, killed everything I needed to actually make that stupid salad. No, I did not. Whew. Oh, I had myself worried there for a sec. Uh, Matt, that just looks creepy, man. So there's not going to be any more recipes for me today. We picked all the flowers yesterday. Please not out. It wouldn't take money off me last time we was anyway. So yeah, we're basically just filling time right now. Um, what's going to be a good way to do that? Honestly, it's just nice not to be rushing. I have recently had the very great good fortune of taking a couple of days off work for the first time since... Uh, I want to say Easter? I think was the last time I took a day off. I'm now alone. I... In theory, I work a 9 to 5. Um, and I say in theory because technically my shift is 8 to 4. Yes, it will lay eggies. Can I show you a sheet? Um, yeah, so technically my shift is 8 to 4, but quite frequently that translates to 7 to 5 sort of dearly. Um, and I completely lost the thread of what I was going to say, so let's just drop that one. I might do some fishing. I need to catch a lot of fish. Oh, I'm going to go talk to Vinny. Thank you. I haven't spoken to Vinny today. I'm just here to chat. Turnberry and a berry mellow. Yeah. Keep the chatter rolling. Cause you're gonna tell me it's all the same thing that you've said to me before. Do, 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 do. Ooh, 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 ooh. Change tune, change tune. Nope. I think I've lost a lot of cups, a lot of cups, a lot of cups. Particularly if there's a year skip. 
will they still be there? Oh, I didn't think of that. I should have thought of that much sooner. Oh, this is gonna be interesting to say the least. Also very interesting that I haven't seen the silver milker, the silver clippers, or the silver rod yet. Now, if it's based on usage, does it have to be for all three? Because I'm fairly certain that I would have used the watering can a heck of a lot more than the sickle or the hoe. And I'm fairly certain I've used the milker a heck of a lot more than the clippers and the fishing rod. Large fishy. This is a heck of a way to see out of here. Catch some fish. We milk some sheep, we shear some goats, we get the cow eggs. We acknowledge the imminent death of our strawberries. <sighs> we sigh deeply. Tell you, if I didn't have to tend to my critters, I would be so tempted. To just call it here. And failed my first request. Now, Daisy, are you finally... Yay! Even across the board. Meeting is next. I think I got excited last time that Ewok was now neutral. Because frankly, I do think that that is fantastic. Matt's sneaking out for his afternoon kippers. Oh, I wonder. Hello, Daryl. It is very, very cold. What happens? If I walk into the forest after you, first I'm going to go put my chickens and my ducks away. And then we'll see. in the outbound. Oh, gold. Thank you to whichever one of my lovely egg-laying critters that was. Looks like that's about it, though. It is really hard to tell close to the pond. You move very slowly, Daryl. Okay, you're not going to go there. I was kind of hoping there'd be an event for Daryl meeting the cryptid. But alas. Melinda is happy. Her happy face makes it look like she's yawning. Can empathize. All right, second brushings. Everybody is 
something sparkling. And honestly, that is very much how they should all start the new year. Sparkling and content. Nobody's pregnant, so I don't have to worry about any unusual durations. At this point, nobody can get pregnant until I upgrade the barn. Which is gonna make it really hard to buy the goat. Yeah. Assuming there is another goat. You have all done marvelously this year. I am happy to ring it out with you. Again, it's surprising to me that there's not a New Year's Eve event. It's a fairly obvious one. But just having the one event per season is, um... Honestly, a little bit daunting. I'm terrified of missing them. Alright, one last check of the crops. And then we're going to save and call it an episode and we will find out the fate of all of my beautiful hybrid crops in our next episode. I really do hope they carry over. If they don't, I am going to be so cranky at myself. There will be miffage. I can watch her sleep. Alright, so we are going to wrap it up there. Thank you very much for joining me in this particular episode. In our next episode, we will enter into year three. I don't know what that's going to entail, but I look forward to finding out. Uh, until then, Ronan Tear signing off, and I will catch you in the next one. <laughs>